when I've played him, I noticed sometimes when he wants to assert dominance, he cracks a little smile. He wasn't cracking many smiles, maybe one or two, and that made me feel very good. Of course, I grew up watching him, I grew up, I've watched all of his interviews, and uh, you know, uh, and he said once in an interview that uh, he spent more than 10 minutes on the move, that's a very bad sign. And, uh, he did that a lot this game. So that, like, that boosted my confidence. I didn't do anything special, he just went to, well, okay, I think I played quite well. And already he's demoralized, right? Because, uh, you know, and then I'm, I played well, you know, I feel bad for him. He has little kicks, you know, and I, I've noticed that, okay, that's maybe a, I should not use that word. Um, he has mannerisms. Okay, even if there's a draw, I think he's just so demoralized because he's losing to such an idiot like me, you know? I'm just uh, absolutely miserable. The fact that I'm, I have not like already gone to, to the mini bar, or the fact that I haven't like just jumped in the pool, or the fact that I'm alive at this moment is a miracle. I wanted to lose as quickly as possible so uh, I could um, go back to my uh, hotel room and uh, turn all the lights off, order some uh, some delivery, and uh, watch Netflix. I'm not going to back down, and I'm going to play my best chess here, uh, regardless uh, of the pressure that I'm under. Uh, you know. Chess speaks for itself, you know. Chess speaks for itself. I'm uh, very impressed by uh, Niemann's uh, play uh, and uh, I think uh, his mentor Maxim Bluge must be doing uh, a great uh, a great job. I have never cheated in an over the board game. Other when I was 12 years old, I have never ever ever and I would never do that. That is the worst thing I could ever do. Cheat in a tournament with prize money. Entdecken, Sabonnez, Abonnieren, Dingue, Podpisovatsa, Subscribe, Suscribete.